All right, excuse the fact that I look like Humpty Dumpty's Aunt Beatrice. <laughs> I should have had a plan before I started recording. So, I put on my Instagram story two uh, aesthetic photos, um, and I told people to choose left or right. Um, I will show the two photos I put up somewhere around the screen, and then I will show you the end results of what people chose. It's somewhere in around the screen. I'll figure it out. Um, so I'm going to recreate a makeup look that is inspired by this photo. Um, and yeah, I hope it's entertaining to watch. I don't know what I'm going to do it. Yeah, I didn't do any plans, didn't draw anything out or whatever. Um, so I'm just going to go with the flow. I'm going to pull up the photo on my phone. Yeah, and then I'm going to just try to recreate a makeup look that's inspired by this photo. Okay, here we go. It's going to be fun. This is the first episode of a series. I'm most likely going to make this a series. Anyways, let's get on with it. All right. <laughs> Let's recap, shall we? Yesterday was a mess, as you saw. I dropped so many things and I brought <laughs> dropped my mirror. You know she's still gonna use it. It's not fully broken. Like you can still use some of that. Oh my god. <laughs> what was I thinking yesterday? Hmm? She thought this was gonna be cute. She thought she's like, oh, I got this great idea. I'm gonna do. <laughs> and then she ends up like. No, ma'am. Did I explain what this was? I don't even know what the. I like tried to erase yesterday from my memory. I'm turning aesthetics into makeup, basically. I think that's what I'm gonna call it, aesthetics to makeup. I'm sure you noticed. All right, let's try this again. Let's get on with the video. All right. So, as you saw in the clownery makeup, I did the freaking blue fucking wings things to make it look like the glasses. And I thought at first that was a great idea. And then you saw the results of that. So <laughs> we're gonna, try to do something similar to what it was but more precise and more good looking uh, i'm using i don't know i'm not a makeup guru guys i'm just i just use what's available to me i'm using the masquerade palette by juvia's place i love that store and i'm using dahlia for the blue part of it i guess you could say this one right here is i'm thinking like hmm to represent the pink smoke, I think I'm gonna put smoke out my bottom with pink. Yeah, you know what? I, I, I have an idea. Okay, okay. Okay. So I'm gonna dip into that blue, right? And I'm gonna do the same thing as yesterday, but better. So she's gonna do a little wing. Can you focus please, maybe? All right, uh, going on. Uh, hopefully I get these even. I probably won't. Oh, that doesn't look even. This guy is more curved. Whatever. They'll be sisters, not twins. Good enough. So now I'm going to not do what I did last time where I colored the whole freaking eye. I'm gonna try to be artistic. Can you even see am I blocking you? I'm sorry. Let's focus you a little better. I know this is such a pleasing angle. Man, I am just messing up today. My battery died, so I had to charge it for like an hour and a half. Now we're back. I finished both eyes with that blue thing. They're not even, but whatever. So I think I'm gonna do 
a pink line under my eyebrow and then a pink smoky eye. I think that would look cute. So I'm gonna dip into, I don't know if, hmm, Bori in the same palette. Do I have another pink? Maybe. This one doesn't have the shade names, but it's the Zulu palette. I'm gonna be using this pink right here. And I am gonna start lining the bottom of my eye. I mean, of my eyebrow. All right, are you focused? Can you see me? I'm just gonna do a pink line. Does that look weird? Sometimes you gotta play outside the box. Think outside the box. Did I say play outside the box? If someone's stuffing you in a box, you need to call the police. <laughs> you know what? Let's color the brow in the front pink. Why the hell not? I kind of think that looks cool. Am I the only one? Yeah. <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna do the same thing as the other one and just color it, the front of it, pink. Okay. All right, so I have that done. I hate that this, it's on autofocus, but it doesn't autofocus. So there, I'm gonna smoke out my bottom with the same pink with a little fluffy brand, blending brush. I don't know, is it clean? Let's rub it on my makeup towel. It's just like a fluffy, is this what the beauty gurus do? If we could focus. They always have trouble when at this part focusing onto the product. It's just a blushy brush, a, a blending brush. Jesus Christ. Use what you can, you know? And what am I doing? Okay, I'm going here. You know what? This one's a little too thick. I'm gonna use a smaller end, like this one. I mean, it already has pink on it. And just do that, and then I'll blend it out with the fluffier one. I make the weirdest freaking faces. I think everyone that does their makeup has some weird face when they're doing certain things on their face. That's kind of cute, right? If you think it's cute, like, hit that like button. Is that what people say? Is that what I'm supposed to say? You know, I'm not really gonna say hit that like button, like. <laughs> I'm not really gonna say uh, like and subscribe besides you know putting in at the end credits I'm not gonna say it vocally because I don't know I feel like you should if you're interested in st certain things you should you'll do it regardless of what I like what I say you know what I mean am I making sense like people are gonna subscribe or like things that they genuinely like so whenever I hear someone on YouTube be like hit that like and subscribe like now I kind of don't want to. <laughs> I don't know. Is that just me? I kind of, like, because that, that's a given, right? Like, if you did like it, you know, or and if you wanted to subscribe and see further of what this person's doing, you would do that instead of, am I making sense? Anyways, that's just a little ramble. I think I'm going to do my waterline pink as well with white liner and then add pink shadow on top. That's what I usually do for color, sh color shadow because I can't afford to get <laughs> a bunch of colorful l liners right now, at least. All right, so this is where I'm at. I don't know. I kind of like it. One thing I like to do when I don't know what to put on the inner corner, I like to swatch a bunch of different inner, col inner corner colors options um, on my fingers. All right, so I swatched these three pinks. Come on, focus on my fingers. There we go. These are pretty, right? And then what I do, I get close up in the mirror and then I do this to see if it looks good. So I'm not doing this one because it's too close to this one. So these are my two options, but I think I like this one more. Yeah, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna use this one because it's just brighter. So I'm wiping those off, grabbing a little inner corner brush or thin brush, whatever you have. It doesn't matter, honestly. Ooh, pretty. Oh, that's so pretty. That's cute. That's the look for the eyes. If I add more things, I'll let you know if I add anything. But for now, I think I'm going to pop some mascara on. Maybe a little black liner to hide the band of the lashes and then 
pop some lashes on and then I'll be right back. Okay, yes. One thing I did, uh, I, I did add, um, I put the Master Chrome uh, highlighter by Maybelline, this one. Um, I put that on my lid. So now I am gonna take this bake off my face because it's been a minute since I had this. Can't even see it anymore. That's how long it's been baking. And I'm gonna contour and highlight and figure out what I'm gonna do with my lips. All right, let's see. We're gonna contour with the e.l.f. contour palette powder. So I dip into this one and then like a little bit of that, the darker one. Tap up the excess off and just go for it with a big brush. And do the same thing again. Get your temples. Last but not least, the chin. Just carve it out because she's got a double chin and you're trying to hide that. You can barely see it. I don't like like severe contour, but I like to look a little not like a ghost. <laughs> now we're going to blush. So I have this really, I got this from the dollar store a long time ago and I just use it because I don't like to waste things. It's like a super pigmented pink it's like a bright pink and i don't like it that intense obviously so i get the uh, milani milani the flower rose blush so i use this kabuki brush i dip in one two tap some of that access off and then i grab the milani one to diffuse this one i put it in the milani one and just brush it out into the pan and there I get a more diffused pink, but more pigmented than the Milani one, if that makes sense. And then I just hit it on my nose. You can see that. And we're just going to go for an anime style blush. Because why not, right? All over. Just who cares? Go crazy. A little on your chin. All right, we're going to do a little bit of more. I don't dip back into the other one. I just go for this one again. Make a weird face while you do it or it's not going to go on right. Right? You smile a little. Get those apples. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. All right, and then... Mm, look at that. Cute. And now we do highlight. I'm gonna do what I used on my lid, the Master Chrome one, and I'm gonna use that as highlight because I can. I like intense highlight like anybody would, honestly, because I like to look at that. Ooh, it's so good. See, look at before, after. Ugh, a little more because I feel like shining bright. I know it's nighttime, but uh-uh, she's changing it to daytime. It's probably way too much highlight, but oh, it's so cute. How are we feeling? Is this... Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Okay. Okay, lips. Oh my gosh, lips. Okay. We're gonna use some chapstick because she's drier than the Sahara Desert. And then we're gonna line with the Jeffree Star. I think it's androgyny. Lip liner. When I outline the bottom, I like to do this because I'm. I don't really like. Sometimes I do, but I don't really like my cupid's bow. So I'm. I like to diffuse it a little by doing this, and it just gets it more rounded. Hmm. Hmm. Mm mm mm. Oh, that's actually cute. I might leave it like that. Pop some of this. I don't know what color this. I I keep hitting the mic. Hmm. And then the fun part some gloss the gloss by Revlon now watch this watch this watch how cool this is gonna be oh you saw that look at the difference I don't like to put a lot of this because it is thick and then it gets like gross and gummy <laughs> all right I'm gonna do my hair and then show you the finished look all right here we go. Here's the finished look. Oh my god. This is a lot better than the other atrocity. Period, Peach. Period. 
my hair I did a quick whatever I think I want to put it up though probably it'll look cuter my bangs let's not talk about her she's not cute today oh my gosh my hair hates me today okay whatever there she is there's the look <laughs> That's the finished look. I'm gonna put up the picture again here. See how much it looks inspired by it. I think if you were to look at this look and compare it to the picture, you'd be like, okay, I see where she was going. What do you guys think? Cute, right? Better than the first one. You cannot argue with me about that, okay? <laughs> this is for sure better than the first one. That's a fact. If you guys wanna see and dramatic makeup and whatnot I feel like this didn't give you BAM you know what I mean so I'll have people on Instagram choose and then that's how it'll turn into a video that's it guys <laughs> thanks for watching um, let me know in the comments what you think if this was a lot better than the first one in the beginning of the video or let me know if you liked the one in the beginning of the video I doubt it but you know who knows there's probably some people that will enjoy it let's uh alfalfa who like ugh. all right yeah thanks guys thanks for watching i don't know what else to say all right see you guys in the next one <laughs>